So, can bubble wrap save your life? Today, we're going to be answering that question by applying bubble wrap to dangerous situations. And I'm even gonna be hit by a car. Don't try this at home. This is a watermelon. And this is a tractor. Fatality. Oh my god. But could a watermelon survive if it was covered in bubble wrap? It's actually in better condition. This is a pumpkin. Ready? Aim. Fire. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Look, I can stick my fist through it. <laughs> this pumpkin's done for, but maybe bubble wrap. We'll save the next one. Fire! Damn. I mean, it kinda helped. The three amigos firework. Here we go. Doesn't seem to be stopping it. Bubble wrap's catching on fire. It's all coming out one hole. <laughs> I don't know how he's just standing there. Well, it's on fire. This one actually turned out worse. Three amigos, no amigos. Pinata with bubble wrap, pinata without bubble wrap. So here's the pinata without bubble wrap. You can see he's absolutely mangled. And this, this is our bubble wrap guy. Look. Actually, they're both kind of fucked up. You know, they say a watermelon is like a human's head. I don't know if that's true, but I have a saw blade. <laughs> I guess bubble wrap isn't the best protection from a saw blade, but you know what it might protect us from? Don't try this at home. Seriously, don't try this at home. I think it helped a little. Watch the next video or I'll come to your house.